How was your weekend? Got any plans for the holidays? In this video, learn all about chatting about weekend and holiday plans, which is another common way Americans make small talk. Since most Americans live for the weekend, it's one of the most common things to chat about with your coworkers. If it's Friday, you'll hear, got any plans for the weekend? Or, are you doing anything fun this weekend? Even grocery store clerks may ask you about your weekend activities. To respond to these questions, you'll probably start the phrase with, I'm gonna since we're talking about the near future. You may also be able to use the present continuous, I'm going with certain activities, like I'm going out dancing tonight. You could also say, I'm gonna go out dancing tonight. Both are correct and have the exact same meaning. I'm gonna is short for I am going to. Here are some more examples. Tomorrow, I'm going to do some errands and watch a movie. Errands are daily living things you need to do outside your house, like buying food, going to the post office to mail a package, or getting a present for your friend's birthday. Use the verb do or run with the word errand. Like this, I have to run an errand or I need to do some errands. And here's one more weekend plan sentence for you. On Sunday, I'm gonna have dinner with my parents and watch football. If you don't have any interesting plans or don't feel like talking, you might just answer the question, are you doing anything fun this weekend? By saying, no, not really or nothing special. Similarly, if a holiday weekend is coming up, just use the word holiday in place of weekend in the question. Are you doing anything special for the holiday? Note, we use the plural holidays usually to refer to the time between Thanksgiving, which is at the end of November in the United States, and New Year's, since this holiday time goes on for several weeks and includes more than one holiday. Now, if it's Monday, you'll hear, how was your weekend? Or, did you have a good weekend? Or possibly, did you do anything special this weekend? For these questions, you'll need to answer using the simple past tense. Answer, how was your weekend with, it was great, or awesome, or very relaxing. Then be prepared to explain what you did. If it wasn't very interesting, you could answer, it was okay, I didn't really do much. But again, when talking about the past weekend, make sure to use past tense verbs. Then make sure to ask your conversation partner about their weekend. Say, how was yours? If they asked, how was your weekend? Say, how about you? If they asked, did you have a good weekend? Make sure you match your question with their question. If they asked, how was your weekend? How was yours is your answer. If they asked, did you have a good weekend? You're going to ask, how about you? So match yours to yours and you to you. As always, when you're new to making small talk with Americans, it may be easier to let them initiate the conversation. The best way to do this is to make eye contact and smile. This is often enough to get someone talking if they're waiting for something and have nothing else to do. Make a note of what they say so you can repeat it in your next conversation. Now go out and practice and leave me a message letting me know how it went. 
Want more small talk practice? Then check out some of my other small talk video topics and also join my email list where you'll receive weekly mini lessons combining small talk and pronunciation. You'll find the link in the description of this video. Thanks for watching.